see the spectacular show last last night? Check this out. These are the Northern Lights. Take a look at the beautiful photos sent in by you, our viewers. Look at the sky lit up in bright pink in North Windham right there, just bursting with color. It's a pretty similar scene in Canaan, too. The sky turning green and dark purple in East Hampton. Unbelievable. That display so many of you saw last night. I even saw them at my house, Anthony, which was quite nice because I never see anything at my house. So well, that was I went, interesting. So I'm in Manchester and I there, you know, there's so much light pollution in Manchester and I was able to see it. I was are, shocked. I was yeah. I walked outside and I'm like, I'm trying to think because my neighbors also go all up for Halloween. So right. there's always purple, orange lights everywhere. Yeah. And I'm looking up and I'm like, oh my gosh, like I think that is the actual light. It's and unbelievable. Yeah, it took a long exposure picture and sure yep. enough, there it is. Went yeah. out to Bark Hampstead. Uh huh. Last night, and then the clouds moved in. Uh, and I was yeah. just like, oh my gosh, like you can see the green coming through the clouds. It's like, are we got to go somewhere else? So we went to New Hartford, or <laughs> sorry, we went to West Hartford. Okay. And just, it was, it was amazing. It was, it was amazing. It was the fantastic. Instagram feed was blowing up, and people were giving the tips too, especially if you watched over the last few days yeah. how you could see them. You have to go, th you know, through the lens of your phone. And just, it was awesome. It, it was just, it was just I crazy. Loved it. So, I want to show you guys this video. This is from Vern. It's a time lapse oh that was sent from Bolton Lake by Matthew. Uh, just, just take a second and just watch this. This is just so incredible. It, it, it's just it, when you see this just kind of right. fade on and off, on and off again. It's just, it's just wild. So big thank you to Matthew for sending sending that into us. Just incredible view over. Look at that. Just how long do you think color. that time lapse is? I would imagine. I honestly, I don't know, to be totally honest with you, but I, I would think that is at least like maybe 15. Yeah. We're going to be talking with him a little bit later on today as well. So oh, fun. I'm, okay, I'm excited good. to hear from He'll him. He'll tell us. It's, that. <laughs> he's going to tell us for sure. All right. But the question, of course, can we see the lights yes. later on this evening? Can you see them yet again? Now, we did see the peak of the storm happen last night, but there could still be some color left over as we head through this evening. The viewing line, the forecast from the Space Weather Prediction Center is technically over us. We'll have to keep the skies clear right now. At present, we still have a strong active storm with K index levels of a 7, but that is expected to slowly decrease as we head through this afternoon and through tonight. So we're going to have to kind of play that wait and see game as we head through this evening. Just like last night, though, uh, look to the north. Rural areas, especially for this evening, you're not going to be able to see them more than likely in places like East Hartford, Manchester, those areas that have big light pollution there. So the long exposure, if we can see them tonight, is going to be best.